This is a video on how to change the specification name within the specification settings in DriveWorks Pro. The specification settings task provides the ability to control the naming and folder location of specifications which are created by running a project. With DriveWorks Pro open and a group and project already open, go down to the specification settings task from the task explorer. Here you can see under the specification name, the rule contains the specification ID with some text before it. You can see that the results value will be the text. In this case, the name of the project followed by the specification ID, which is auto incrementing. DriveWorks has a built-in variable known as special variables that can be used in rules. The special variables are found in the rules builder from the quick text dropdown. Every time a project is running DriveWorks Pro, it's allocated a guaranteed unique incrementing number called a specification ID, which is combined with the name of the project to give the running project its specification name. The specification name needs to be unique for every specification that is created. To do this, we recommend the use of the special variable DW specification ID. Here we can look into the specification results folder where you can see some existing specifications that have been created and listed. There is the name of the project in text and then the specification ID number which as mentioned is auto incrementing and provides the project specification with a new specification number each time it is generated. Let's go to the Specification Explorer task and run a new specification through. The last specification ID that used was 0053, so we should expect the next one to be 0054. Click onto the New button from the command bar and fill out the forms to generate a new specification. Then click onto Release. Within the specification list, you can see that the newly generated specification has been given a unique ID number of 0054. Back in the specification settings within the task explorer, let's change the specification name rule to something different. To do this, click onto the build button and add some more text into the rule so that it results in a different value. Click on OK to accept the change in the rule and then move back to the specification explorer. Click on save and run through a new specification to check that it's updated correctly. After you have clicked on release, you can see that it has been added to the top of the list with the amended specification name, as well as the new specification ID number of 0055. For more information, click on the help button anytime whilst using DriveWorks Pro, or visit the online help file which can be found at docs.driveworkspro.com.